Hi guys, hello everyone. I hope all of you are doing fine. So in my last uh, videos, I have got a feedback that uh, these questions should be in English. So from now onwards, I would be trying to record these uh, questions in English. <coughs> Welcome everyone again. So today we are having a third question of this uh, flop series. Let us move to the question directly. <coughs> A block of 5 kg is placed on an inclined plane with angle 37 degrees. What is the range of capital F applied on block up the incline so that the block does not slip with respect to incline? The coefficient of friction between the block and the incline is 0.2. So first of all, pause the video and uh, try for it. Okay. So, uh, there is this capital F shown, we need to find out that what is the range of this capital F. I mean, uh, that what is the minimum value that we can apply, what is the maximum value of uh, capital F that we can apply, so that the block does not move with respect to incline. Okay. Uh, first of all, let us start uh, with the free boy diagram for this block. So 5 kg block, uh, there will be a normal force. In this direction okay and I am taking the components of mg mg sine 37 down the incline okay hold on hold on hold on mg sine 37 down the incline which is 50 sine 37 and mg cos 37 mg cos 37 will be perpendicular to incline which is 50 cos 37 this will become 40 and mg sin 37 is 30 correct okay a uh, coefficient of friction is given as 0 0.2 let us also find out what is the maximum value of friction possible maximum value of friction possible uh, will be mu into normal in this case, uh, mu is 0 0.2, normal will be mg cos 37 which is 40. So this will be coming up as 8 Newton. So maximum value of friction possible is 8 Newton. Right. Question is, find the range of capital F. Let us suppose we do not apply any capital F. Let us see what happens. If we do not apply any capital F, then this is the block 30 newton force which is mg sin 37 mg sin 37 it will try to move the block downwards capital f is not applied the block is trying to go downwards but friction is trying to stop it with the force of 8 newton maximum value of friction possible is 8 newton it is acting upwards it is trying to stop the block is the block stopping i don't think so there is a net force of 22 newton that's why the block is not stopping so it means we have to apply some external force now so let me apply the external force how much minimum external force required minimum external force required will be 22 newtons if you apply 22 newton of the external force then the block is just at rest am i right and with the capital f 22 newton friction 8 newton is also required that is correct now let us suppose i increase my external force to 30 newton or let us say before 30 let us say 28 newton i i will increase my capital f to 28 newton then what will happen will the block move upwards 28 plus 8 is uh, 36 so will the block move upwards no we know that friction is very intelligent force it will try to adjust itself now the requirement of friction to stop the block is only 2 newton so friction acting will be 2 newton and this friction friction is acting up the incline to stop the block yes or no friction will be acting according to the requirement now suppose i increase my force to 30 newton uh, then there is no requirement of friction the block is at rest external force is 
keeping the block at rest there is no requirement of friction correct now let us suppose i increase my force to 35 newton 35 newton upwards 30 newton downwards now the friction will adjust itself friction will be 5 newton but in the downward direction getting it up the incline 35 newton down 30 newton friction will also act downwards to stop the block with respect to wedge and that requirement of friction is 5 newton do we have 5 newton available yes up to 8 newton we are having the friction so if i apply the force of let us say 38 newton then i need a friction force of 8 newton downwards to stop the block right if i increase my force to 40 newton then the requirement of friction is 10 newton but i am having maximum 8 newton so the block will start moving yes or no so the minimum value of force is 22 newton the maximum value of force is 38 newton in which the block will remain at rest so the range of capital f is 22 newton to 38 newton and both inclusive i hope you get it right now if you like this question then like the video as well and share it with your friends and ask them that are you able to solve this question and if you share uh, this video this question will be reaching to many many students who would uh, really like to solve this question share it and comment on it that were you able to solve this question before my answer and if you want to suggest any better way to solve this question you are again welcome any feedback for this question just write down in the comment box all right so we'll be meeting up in the next question of this flop series take care bye